read series where I do a first reading of a poem by a poet I don't know or don't know very well and just do a first reading for the sheer joy of it, I'm not reading it like a teacher or a writer or anything, just reading to see what's there and maybe I'm right, and maybe I'm wrong, maybe it's a brilliant reading, most of the time it's not, it's just what's there. I tend to read things quite differently a second or third time and I go back and I think through it in connection to other poems by that poet or to theory or other poets, things like that. This one. This one is from Contraviento Journal. Contravientojournal.org. It's the web website. It's a journal that deals largely with the West. And the I can't think of it as the sage breast of the West. It's a fun journal. A lot of difference, a lot of variation on it. Not just a certain kind of form. I do look at form as the first thing when I look at any poem, and I think that's what drew me to this one. I just looked at it like it's playing around the page inside the lines. It's got these, you know, little sections. You know, I haven't read it, so I don't know what it's about, but, you know, formally, these little sections in between it, they're kind of sandwiched in, and it looks like a letter with a sincerely and sir. I'm not sure who the sir is. This one is by Claire Mushke. Sorry, I probably just slaughtered your name. Um, and I don't know. I don't know Claire. I'm just going to read her stuff. Sir, in this particular case, it will be noted. This letter being thrown, it feels like the first sir, the italicized part. It almost feels like it's from something. Boss throws his arm, index pointed to me, look anywhere but at me. He calls the land to his to cover land. He calls, gnarly calls her old denim. Love the sound of this this poem so far. I mean, I, I don't know about others, but like, I don't always have to even know what a poem means if I love the sound of it. I just like to get into it. This one looks like it's playing around with lots of different images and jumping from things. That the boss index his throws his arm index pointed to me look anywhere but at me he calls land to his covered land he calls gnarly calls her old denim man and i both had slain limbs weeks apart then weeks apart panic there's this real play they're like jumping around here a lot almost feel like we're getting an image of a place and a time more than we are like a meaning we're supposed to be following through Chalk green, trucks, fence, yard, boat, helicopter, livestock. Eagle and doe, carcass, yeah, it feels very much like we're getting this image here of, uh, of the West. How to approach underground roots, spread fire, widowers, a trunk, almost ash once in Albuquerque. I threw out expired boxes, swore quietly into a dumpster. This is like, feels like we're back just having life, the thrown out expired boxes, like there's such a job um, off and on in it. Swore quietly in a dumpster along the food bank, kids who only ate non-perishables during school day hungers. A wild horse, a nest of sage, waited in my stomach. And this brings up so many different images, the kids in school eating, the food bank, and their job, and this what hunger is. Since the alleged mother was an Indian, this is italicized as being, in particular case, it will be noted that the alleged mother was an Indian. It's like it's been taken from some letter that's accusatory, and all the other stuff is just life thrown in there. It is going to rain when he shouts, I feel it in my bones. When one stopped dancing, everyone became a ghost town. I never knew the name. If you brush an inhale with a finger on sight, you can find turquoise. This is an interesting image. Like, you can brush this inhale, there'll be turquoise, and it's jumping around like the ghost town. It's going to rain. The sound is still really cool. Um, really nice sound in all of this. Like, some birds attracted to blue, she dropped, and, and it just jumps from one thing to the next. Sometimes the spaces are in there with it to help. She so dropped an instant into a crease. I 
It is the crease in the person's palm, so she's dropping an instant into a crease in the palm. I like the idea of dropping an instant anywhere. The day after I was fingerprinted for a federal job, the cop went back, back at a job again, being fingerprinted, talk, kindergarten, crafts, crime, snowflakes, ethnicity. It's like chit-chat between this person and the cop. Not fitting inside the form gave me a new draft. Not fitting inside the form because of what? Because of ethnicity because of ancestry then showed me a sink like as a place it feels like a you know place to go pee for the drug test or something at the end sincerely written in it's like written through the letter here is what is here are the details that weren't in the letter that are here written for us wow it's a fun poem i mean i don't know that i said anything profound about it but the poem i feel like would definitely reward a second or third reading. Um, it's very rich. Really musical sound to it. I really liked 